Welcome to day 6. Break the pace. It's okay to pause. Daily life and work are too fast paced. We barely get time to relax and breathe. Some people feel so guilty about taking a short break at work. Many of you may feel that you will lose out on time if you take a pause, right? Hi there, I am Costa Oberoi, your mental health expert. People make resolutions on fitness and nutrition, but they often forget about mental health. And those who make mental health resolutions don't know how to stick to them. And so Aditya Birla Health Insurance and I are here with some mind hacks on how to stick to those health resolutions that you made this year. We bring to you hashtag let the mind games begin on the active living community. This 14 day health program will teach you how to trick your mind to be on track of your health resolutions. Today is day 6 where we will let out the secret of how stepping on the break to take that break can bring calmness amidst all the chaos and can help you move faster in life. It's high time that we change our thinking that taking a break means wasting time and that we should feel guilty about it. It is completely human to stop and give yourself time to pause and take a deep breath as you process it all. So here are some tricks that you can use to hit the pause button. Number 1. You can set aside specific times for unplugging from technology, such as designated phone-free times or a daily tech break. This can help you avoid distractions and be more present with the people and tasks in your life. Number 2. You can practice gratitude by taking a few minutes each day to write down three things that you are grateful for. This can help shift your focus to the positive aspects of your life and cultivate a sense of appreciation. Number 3. Take time out to do absolutely nothing. Sit in a park or a peaceful place of your liking and just do nothing. Not even use your phone. Observe your surroundings and make it worth your time. Use your senses to ground yourself in the present moment. For example, you could take a few deep breaths and focus on the smells and sounds around you. Or try paying attention to the textures and taste of the food as you eat. Number 4. Engage in activities that allow you to fully focus and be present, such as yoga, painting or gardening. These activities can help you cultivate mindfulness and increase your awareness of the present moment. Number 5. Take a break from your busy life to do things that you love, such as traveling, cooking or simply catching up on your favorite movie or TV show. And finally, number 6. Let me introduce you to my favorite relaxation technique that helps calm me down. It's called the 478 breathing method. This technique gets rid of my stress, reduces my anxiety and even helps me fall asleep. And isn't sleep the best break that our mind and body can get? So let's try it out together. Close your mouth and take a deep breath for 4 counts. Now hold the breath for 7 counts. Finally exhale through your mouth for 8 counts, making a whoosh sound. Great work! Practice this method daily to hit the pause button in your stressful life. So just take a break from your slow and slow life in the middle of your life. Thoda relax karo without feeling guilty about it. If you would like to know how stepping on the brake pedal can help you immensely, read the article below. Stay healthy with Active Living, your everyday health expert. Watch out for the next few days. Let the mind games begin.